What's up everyone? Today we're going to be going over leak code number 14. This is a pretty well-known problem, I think, but the input is going to be a, an array of strings and they want the string which is most com which is common among all of them. So flower, flow and flight have fl in common. They start with dog, race, car and car have nothing in common that they start with. Race car and car have car that they end with. But what we need is for everything to work out. So the way we can do this is kind of thinking of finding the lowest common denominator almost. Like if we had 2, 4, and 8, 2 is going to be the common factor. So similarly, we can find the common factors between each word. So let's, let's write the method first to give us a string of, of um, two, a common string common prefix is given two strings so string common string s1 string s2 uh, we use a string builder because in Java strings are immutable We'll have two pointers, int i is equal to 0, int j is equal to 0, int m is equal to s1 dot length, l-e-n-g-t-h, and int n is equal to s2 dot length. So while i is less than m and j is less than n we're going to do while s1 dot char at i is equal to s2 dot char at j pretty much what this is going to look like is this a flower and flow we're going to have in pointer i and j, and these are going to keep incrementing every single time that they're equal, and every time they're equal, we add sb to the new, we append sb. While these two are equal, sb dot append s1 dot char at i and then we increment i plus plus and j plus plus. If i is equal to m or j is equal to n, we break we break this um, inner while loop, and then we'll also break the outer while loop because all we need is, for example. FLOW. At this point, we have the prefix we need, so we can return SB dot to string. Now, what this method common does is, given two strings, it'll give you the prefix that is common right in the beginning. Now that the work is done, you can just use this to. Find of, kind of find the least common denominator for all these. So if the input is, say, string prefix, if this is what, I can't remember what the exact method says on, on the leak code, but it, it's something like this. So string ARR, so what we need um, string w a r r of zero. I'm assuming that the array is going to have at least more than one. So for string for str for string s through a r r w is going to be passed into common 
W and S. And then all we have to do is return W. Now, let me just go over what this is going to look like code-wise. So first, it's going to be flower and flower. The common of this is going to be flower. So first, it's going to be pretty much ARR of 0 and ARR of 0 compared with each other. Now, flower is going to be compared with the second one, flow. And the thing that's going to get spit out is FLOW. Now, FLOW is going to be put in with flight. And we're going to get FL as a return. And that's what we return as a W. So that's how you solve leak code number 14. Thank you.